Alright guys, no, wait. Alright guys, this is why you should get Black Ops 2, and maybe why it's not as good as other Call of Duties. Same problem as Modern Warfare 3, basically. Alright, the main reason you should get it is because of, like, it's gonna have a very awesome Zombies campaign. If you're not a fan of zombies, you should stop playing it. It starts on World at War, progresses on Black Ops, and ultimately it should be on Black Ops 2, which there's already leaked footage of. Apparently there's a campaign and you can like play and get to know the storyline, even though there already is one with basically four main characters which are on their travels about element 115 or something like that. And, yeah, you should get it because of that. There's not really too much else. The campaign doesn't look the best either. It's, it's not like a typical COD. Alright, multiplayer. Doesn't look so impressive. It's got the same basic thing like Call of Duty 4. Nothing much different apart from weird weapons. Like... There's even like some sort of mirror which you put up and it like reflects sunlight into the enemy. Don't see how that would be effective. Anyway, I'm not too impressed with this Call of Duty so far, but the zombies does look good. Yeah, and I was, as I was saying, it's not like a typical Call of Duty campaign. Black Ops, Modern Warfare, Modern Warfare 2 have very nice campaigns to it. You should see how good it is. If you play more and you play this, I bet you this will be a very different and weirder. So, yeah, it doesn't look as good. Thanks guys, uh, comment, rate and subscribe and put thumbs up.